see that we've just left Grobler's Hoop and we are heading to Uppington. Uh, Uppington is about 115 kilometers from Grobler's Hoop and uh, it's going to be a tar road all the way there. Uppington, 20 kilometers to go. It's been yonks. Hey. crossing the Orange River. What? <laughs> Look at that one. Yeah. What a way to welcome us to Uppington. Look at those houses there on the side. How gorgeous is that? Oh. Beautiful. So our first mission is to find the Kalahari Mall. Yes for some dinner for this evening. Okay, dogs. She'll tell me how to drive. Yes. We need to turn right here. So we continue on the Protea Hotel, Uppington. Have a good look. Definitely. See, nineteen thirty. Not quite sure what it is. Labour Centre, Uppington. Post office. Yeah, they need a big post office, I'm yeah, sure. For sure. Okay, we shall come back to you tomorrow. Definitely. <laughs> for sure, it's beautiful. Yes. And 
that is we turn left here Department of Health, Northern Cape. Okay. Wow, is it? What a big mall. Yeah. Yeah, this is big, eh? <laughs> looking for? Panerotis. Oh, we've got our foodies. This is a Lani Mall, eh? Seriously nice mall. It looks busy. It's busy, but it's really nice. It's, it's quiet and people are calm inside. It's, it's a nice place. Okay. Yeah. And they have pasta for me, so I can't, <laughs> I'm looking forward to my pasta. Chicken nice trees. Beautiful. This is pretty. We're on this road. Check the water in the canal, it's like insane. Huh? Wow. The gate in the middle. Yes. Is it this one? Let me call. No chicken started at six. I know, I was in the mall and it all went dark. Oh, okay. Shall we just go straight? Up to the top. Cool. There she is, yes. What a stunning place we have to stay at tonight. And I can't believe we made it in daylight. It's light shooting now, so it's pretty dark, but it's cool. I'm using the load shedding light to show you what the bathroom looks like. It's nice. And then the little kitchenette.
pretty is this? Yeah. Oh, this is a beautiful garden, eh? As you know, we stopped off at Panerotti's to get ourselves some pasta. Sonia was in the mood for pasta. So she got herself Alfredo with fettuccine and I got myself spaghetti bolognese. What a beautiful place to close off for the evening. We're going to eat that pasta now and then we're just going to relax. It's load shedding at the moment, so I can't do anything. So just sit and have a beer and enjoy ourselves and we'll see you in the morning. So we stayed in number one, Root House, Root Heist Guest House. Yes. And what a beautiful place yeah. it is. No, I really loved it. Truly an oasis here in Huffington, yeah. hey? Yeah, incredible. So tranquil. It's just the greenness. Astonishing. And we completely overslept. <laughs> Totally. So um, we'll check out a few things in Uppington, you said. Yeah, we've got a few things we can look at and um, then we'll have to hit the road. Yeah. Love the town, I must say. <coughs> it's actually very green, eh? Yeah. Look at this. And uh, we were fortunate, I think, last night to arrive it was still quiet or when it was quiet already yes reformed church yeah. 1976 Pasta was excellent last night. Yeah, it was great. Loved it. I really enjoyed it. It was a good idea of yours. I've been feeling for pasta for so long now, <laughs> and we've never gotten around to it. Municipal swimming pool. Yes, look at this. No way to get in here. No. Wow, I can't get in. I'd love to see what it looks like. Only if we have to see if it's still functional. It looks 
just as if it is though, right? Yeah, I would the say. The lawns are manicured. I know, it's, it's definitely still functional. Oh, that's great to see. Very neat. Such a pity I can't get into the pool, eh? A locked up boot solid, eh? Yeah. Well, makes sense. A pretty old church, eh? Yes, Dutch Reform. Uppington North Congregation. Yes. So if they've got a North and a South Congregation, it shows you what a big place it is. Correct. Eh? This is what I wanted to see. We saw it as we passed by. Oh, yes, it's so cool. Yeah, I'd love to know what it's about. I hope there's something about it here. Very interesting. Looks like a policeman on a camel. So pretty cool to you. We found out that this is to honor the police who uh, used to patrol the Kalahari on camels in the frontier days and it's a bronze monument that's fantastic I love this it's beautiful I love the camel yeah stopping. Yes. I saw people from Gauteng stopping as well to have a look. <laughs> we got a glimpse of the church last night. Yes we did. It looks really beautiful. It does really look stunning. o'clock in the morning and it's still not that crazy. I love that. This is not too bad. I really expected it to be much much busier. Yeah. But it's also the middle of the month. It's yeah. not the end of the month. Yeah, people aren't spending much now. Yes. shop imaginable Yo. and bank <laughs> I saw something about Saki Saarki and here it says Saki Saarki yeah it's a camping site and sundown cruises everything oh. look at this right this is gorgeous color. yes how pretty is this this is beautiful The river boat is also called Saki Saarki. Yeah, How cool is that? Fantastic. There are people, people are fishing. Yeah, people fishing. Swimming. Camping, got their boats here, the works. This is wild, eh? That is so beautiful. 
One day when we come and spend more time in Uppington, I'd like to take a, a river cruise. That would be fantastic. I think it would be stunning. Can we just go a bit closer to the boat? I think that is so cool. Yes, me too. What an oasis. This is for people in Uppington. Yes. People are fishing, they've got their boats here, they've got braai areas, they can camp here. Yeah? If I lived in Uppington, this would be one of my hangouts. <laughs> oh, absolutely. And very regularly too, I'm sure. I love it here. Yeah, fantastic. Oh, oh. oh there's another riverboat. Yes. Like it, eh? Oh, it was very cool. Very nice. Yes. Look at the donkey monument. In the grounds of the church? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it must be in the grounds of the church. So it's load shedding. You can hear the generators running. But I have to come to the donkey monument. How pretty this is. So this monument of the donkey is to recognize the contribution the donkey made to the development of the Lower Orange River Valley. That is so cool. So this is the Kalahari Oranya Museum. It looks like it was a church at some stage. But it's not open now, I can't get inside. Whoa, look at this view. There's again one of these pumps that used to pump out the water. Reminds me of those oil pumps, like I've said before. And look at this. This is now what the donkey used to most probably turn around and bring out water. That is amazing. Look how deep it goes. Plows. 
This is incredible. The little baking ovens, buck oinkies. What? How beautiful is this place? And this is the view they used to have with their quiver trees. Man, oh man, this place is beautiful. I'm not going to hurt you. Hey. So this stone was laid on the 16th of March 1946. This is the first soda machine ever used in Uppington. This is, it's the, I think it's the first version of a soda stream. <laughs> So credit should go to two people. Okay. Reverend Schroeder, who built this church as part of the mission station in 1875. What? And uh, Henny Portretter, who is responsible for the donkey sculpture in bronze. Wow. His name's on the plaque there. Oh, yeah. okay. That's fantastic. Eh? It's a beautiful place. This is this a gorgeous is a town. must visit. When you come, I'm, st I'm st amazed at Uppington. Yeah, it's a too. beautiful, clean town. It's a fantastic place. The vibe yeah. is fantastic too. Okay, I've composed myself. This is Key Solar One, KHI. It's Africa's first concentrated solar power, thermal power plant, uh, just outside Uppington. And uh, one can see the 205 meter tower on the horizon from the N14 where we are now, surrounded by 4,200 massive wall-like solar mirrored panels. Wow. Um, it's 140 hectares in size, the plant, and it produces 50 megawatt of energy. So what a fitting end to our visit to Uppington, eh? Yeah, I mean, it's the, the crown on top of a fantastic visit. Um, yeah, the glimpse into Uppington was fantastic. I want to come back. No, I really enjoyed it. The place where we stayed was fantastic. The town is amazing. Definitely will be. It was fantastic.
was a good, good, good visit. Loved it.